so I wanted to show you guys the process that I used to do this ink owl. This was actually just um, a doodle from the other day. And um, it might look like there's a lot of levels, but actually um, the steps that I used that I'll show you make, make it a lot easier um, to work on. And it was basically just two pens. Um, this like mustard color ink pen and then the ballpoint pen that I've been using. And so I know I draw a lot of owls, but it's a, I think it's good to have something that you feel confident drawing, um, whether you do it every day or once in a while. Anytime I can't sort of think of anything else to do, right, I will draw an owl because the important thing is that you keep doing it. And um, it's also a good way to measure your progress. So in other words, if I have an owl drawing from three years ago or five years ago, I can compare it with the ones I just did, right? And say like, how has it improved? What have I learned? Um, so that's always really important. Um, and actually there is, so there's this owl doodle, um, this tiger, which was done with the same method, um, and then another owl. So um, today I'm gonna switch up the colors actually. Those are all sort of um, brownish, yellowish. Um, tones and today I'm going to do it in greenish and bluish tones right so I have my reference photo and I have sort of my I guess when it's done it's sort of an accent color but I actually start with this and so what I did was basically draw everything out in this color even if I end up going over it right so when I look at my reference photo, what I want to think is, okay, there are areas that are colored and there are areas that are white, right? Like these feathers in here are white. There's some white in here. There's some white in here. But I'm going to start with the darkest area. So maybe like the pupil around the eye, these dark feathers, right? That's just sort of like a good point to start at and sort of go from there. Um, okay, so I'm going to start basically right here, the front part of this eye, is what I'm going to draw in first. Right, so there's the front of the eye. Let me make a little more progress and hopefully you'll be able to tell what the heck I'm doing. Right, so there's the basic shape of the outside of the eye. So now I can go in we'll put a little highlight right there. And again, I know that I'm going to color over this in a minute, but the point is to get as much uh, sort of information in here first as I can. So I guess think of it as doing the entire drawing in blue and then adding the, um, the darker black afterwards. All right, and there's this dark shape above the eye. Now the shape that these sort of feathers create, right, I'm just going to sort of draw that outline and then fill it in. And I'm not doing this in pencil first, ob well, obviously. Um, And I'm leaving a couple um, sort of white areas in here. 
right? And that's on purpose, just because when I go over and start coloring this again, it'll leave um, almost like a little bit of um, extra sort of depth, if you will. Right, so I'm just going to continue on like this and I'm drawing just the darkest parts first so I need to do um, right like some darker areas up in here I need to do um, the ears are those ears on an owl I don't know this part um, some of this darker area in here and the beak um, so I'm going to finish that up basically just doing exactly um, the way that I have done this part. Um, and then I'm going to um, grab the ballpoint pen and go from there. So let's get this finished up and then we'll make the next video.